Happy Monday, everyone. Today's reading is from Luke chapter 4, verses 24 to 30. In today's gospel, Jesus spoke of two depressing situations, the story of the widow and the lepers of Israel. Sa pagbasa, sinabi ni Jesus na sa isang balo lamang dumalaw si Elijah at isang may ketong lang sa dami ng mga kitongin ang pinagaling ng Panginoon. And when the people heard this, they were all furious. From the point of view of the many widows suffering, to hear that only one is chosen by God would surely cause them frustration, anger, and hopelessness. Marami ang magtatanong, Bakit sa isang balo lamang dumalaw si Elijah? Why only to one was he sent and not to all of them? Isn't it unfair and unjust for the rest of the widows suffering for a long period of time? At gayon din sa mga may ketong, anong sakit na malaman na isa lamang ang pinagaling sa dami ng nananalangin? Mahal ba sila ng Diyos o... Pinabayaan na ba sila? Like those widows and lepers, most of us who have been praying hard for a period of time, wishing to get free from our long-time struggles in life, and hoping to get away from what has been making our life difficult, miserable, and sad, would really feel deprived and abandoned when after all these years, they still get no help. Pero, Kung tayo ang katulad ng balong dinalaw ni Elijah o ng may sakit na ketong na pinagaling ng Panginoon, it is a victorious and joyous moment. Such a great feeling for them to be the chosen ones. I'm sure mag-uumapaw din ang ligaya natin kung pakikinggan ng Panginoon ang ating mga dasal at ipagkakaloob ang ating mga hinihiling sa buhay. We would feel so lucky to be lifted up from what's causing our pain and hardships in life. We would surely celebrate for our answered prayers. But whichever situation we are in, whether we are one of the many widows and lepers who are still waiting for our salvation, or we are the lucky ones who get an answered prayer, God's message for us is the same. To wait patiently and not cease from praying. Ang pag-ibig at awa ng Diyos ay nananatili para sa lahat at patuloy na umaasa at tumatawag sa Kanya. Maniwala ka lang kapatid at manalig sa biyaya ng Panginoon. It is just a matter of staying in God's love and wait for God's timing. Because no matter how long the wait may be, God's timing is always perfect. And God's grace is always sufficient. So that's our reflection for today. To watch other videos, please subscribe to our YouTube channel, Facebook.ph, or download the Facebook apps, or visit and register at www.facebook.ph. Thank you.